All right, great, welcome. My name is Angelo and I'm with Discount Wholesalers Incorporated. Uh, right now in this video tutorial, I'm gonna show you guys how to use our manifest, our online uh, manifest that we have on our Google Drives. Uh, this particular one here is the CVS uh, Palette Main. Okay, uh, you can get this from one of our sales reps or you either received it via email uh, and it will be available shortly on our website to download as well. This particular file here is uh, updated every 24 hours. So it's not necessarily real time, but it's it's pretty accurate. Um, just to give you an overview, uh, you do not have to have a, a Gmail account to access these. Okay, um, you can view them from your phone or you can view them from the computer. It is a little easier on the computer. Uh, to start off, I'll explain uh, what we're looking at here. Uh, column A is the load ID. This is the truck number that these particular pallets came in. Uh, column B is the category. C is the container number. This is the actual pallet number. All of these products are sold by the pallet, and uh, this particular manifest is only CVS merchandise, uh, and it uh, comes in different categories. So it comes in non-food. So non-food would be a mixture of general merchandise with health and beauty. Uh, it would not include any food items, though it may include, you know, maybe some candies here or there. Um, that's what the description is, the quantity, how many pieces per pallet, what the retail cost was, what the wholesale cost uh, was or is, and what we're selling it to you at. So we sell every category at a different percentage. All of our non-food is sold at 15%. So on this particular pallet here, all right, this would be the pallet ID. If you wanted to order this one, you would tell them it would be CVS pallet 4134. This would be your price. These are on non-food. If we scroll down, the next category is going to be food. Okay, same exact thing. This is the truck category, the pallet number, description, quantity, all right, and your price. Food is done at 13. These are our health and beauty, okay? So these would be assorted, you know, health and beauty palettes. These are at 21%. Uh, next thing we have is general merchandise. So these would be, you know, these are very similar to the non-food palettes, uh, just that they're gonna probably bring, you know, larger items. Uh, but these can also bring a little bit of health and beauty. That's why it's important to uh, learn how to read these manifest. These are uh, toilet, uh, these are paper towel uh, palettes that we have, right? These are all bounty. And the last one is this Christmas seasonal one. So every single line here is a palette. So give or take a few. If you notice down here, we're at 436. Obviously, we have a lot of white spaces, you know, around these. But we have a few hundred palettes um, in stock at all times of CVS. All right. So we'll get into it a little bit more. So the main is pretty much a summary of everything that we have. Uh, every single tab now, this would be non-food. All right. If we're looking at food, then we would go to food, you know, health and beauty and cosmetics, GM, paper and seasonal. These are the different manifests for them. And I'm gonna teach you uh, how to search for these, okay? And how to find some of the stuff online, just so you guys can do a little bit of research. And that way you can be an educated buyer and make sure you guys are purchasing the things that you guys actually want, all right? So for example, um, these are the palette IDs, okay? When we do a search, we're only gonna use the last four digits. So for example, we'll start off with this one, the non-food, 4134. We'll go into the non-food tab. We're gonna hit Control F, okay, to do a search. And it's gonna be, on this one was 4134. So we'll do 4134, and it brings us here. So this is the manifest for 4134. If we notice here, we scroll all the way down. 4134 had a total of 111 pieces. If we go back to the summary, it shows 111, okay? And then here, it, it's gonna give us a detail of what's included. It gives us UPCs, uh, you know, a vague description of what it is. Now, a lot of these UPCs may not be complete, okay? So there's a tool that I use. Uh, it's called uh, it's called bulkbarcodegenerator.com, and it has an option for checking the digits. Uh, the digits. I'll leave the link to this under the YouTube video also, so you guys can use it. When I go back here, let's say, for example, um, I want to search for one of these products. I can bring it in here, or, or here, we can. So we'll go to Amazon, for example. This is the regular UPC. Probably won't bring anything up. Uh, now the one that I ran through here. So is that it? So if you notice, it added an extra digit, so it found the digit for us. All right, so this one comes up with Nerf Fortnite Super Soaker Toy Gun. And here it is, SO. So it's the, the Nerf Fortnite 
All right, looks like it, it is super soaker. Okay, so that's one of those. Let's see what the next one is. Right, and this one here is telling me, if I go back to the manifest, it says Honeywell doesn't tell me exactly what it is. Uh, it told me that it was retailing for $39.99. So it, it's probably one of these. It's probably actually this product. This is it right here. It's, this is just how it looks in the box. So by using these tools, you can actually go through, analyze your manifest, um, see what you're buying. Uh, now, keep in mind that the CVS truckloads, they're all shelf-pulled items. So these are not uh, case-packed items. So these items have been on store shelves in previous seasons. So they may you know, be some dings in the boxes they're not customer returns so everything should be in, in good condition but again these are liquidations now um we could do this with every single you know uh category we have let's say for example if we were to go down now and i was going to go to health and beauty or even food let's say on, on one of these right let's say i want to look at the food so i would look at 4088 again control f or if it's still up 4088 all right finds the load here and let's say we'll look at this first UPC here. Now, it may not work for everything. There's going to be certain ones that you may have some issues. They may not be on Amazon. Then you want to look at them in Google. But at least, you know, it's going to give us a better idea. Look, these are Boost High Energy Protein Shakes. And it's Rich Chocolate. And if we look here, it's Boost, you know, High Protein Chocolate. So that's what these are. Um, here, I'll do a really quick one also for Health and Beauty. To here, I'm gonna look at this palette here. Palette has 918 pieces. This is the sell price, it's 4182. Go to Health and Beauty, we'll do 4182 on it. Here it is. Okay, we'll look for this first one again. I'm just gonna give a quick test without using the bulk check tool. If you notice, nothing came up. If I put it in here, we run it, it gives us the correct UPC. And there it goes. It gives us the Creme Shop 49 Liquid Foundation. If we come here, Creme Shop um, MM Liquid Foundation. All right. You can also use the same UPC in Google. All right. We can just do a, a quick Google search for it also. All right. And it comes up here. All right. So again, it's very simple. We just uh, use the summary page, all right, in the main page to, you know, identify a palette that's within our price range. Okay. And then we just go into the tab for that particular palette. You know, we'll show again. For example, 0582, we'll go here. We'll do control F for find 0582. I hit the down arrow until I find the actual, because right here it's just picking up the UPCs, but here it is. Now I've picked up the 0582, here it is. All right, and these are the products. If you notice, this is Health and Beauty. This is Centrum's Women, so I know this is a vitamin. You know, if I put it back in here. If you notice, look, I just put the UPC up. It's finished at 5571, and it's 5571, and then it identified that it was missing the one. Now with this one here, I can just either just put it right in here. And it shows the product. All right, I could have done the same thing in Amazon. All right, so I hope that this video tutorial will uh, show you guys how to analyze these manifests. We have a lot of customers now that make a lot of money with the CVS be it flea market vendors, uh, discount stores, online sellers. So, you know, this is um, a, a good opportunity for you guys. You know, uh, I, I generally tend to tell a lot of our customers that if they do sell, you know, in flea markets, that they should also be selling, you know, parallel on Amazon and eBay so you can maximize your profits picking the better products to sell online and then the rest of the products liquidate either in your physical store or at a flea market. Again, uh, my name is Angela and I'm with Discount Wholesalers. Uh, our website is discountwholesalersinc.com. Okay, this is it right here. If you guys have any questions, you guys can feel free to contact our 1-800 number, use the contact us button, or by emailing sales at discountwholesalersinc.com. Thank you very much for watching. Have a good day.